welcome to my channel my name is dexy if you're new here and if you're a returning subscriber hey girl and welcome back and thank you so much for subscribing and if you're not subscribed already please subscribe because i'm gonna be teaching you a lot on how to make body butters diys unboxing etc so here you see me melting down the shea butter using the double boiler system so what I like to do is add my oils after the butter is melted, but you could also add your oils while it's being melted. And don't be wasting no oils because them oils is very, very precious. As you can see, I'm using my spatula to try to get it all out, okay? And I'm just going to give it a quick little stir and add it to the freezer for about an hour, and then I'll be right back. So this is how it looks after about an hour very solid but not all the way solid so how you want your butter you want it to be solid around the edges and on top but very liquidy in the middle so this time i'm doing it a little bit different so i'm adding my fragrance oil my arrow powder and my pigment before I start whipping it usually I would add it while I'm whipping it but this time I want to add it before and this works very well as well guys if you enjoy watching videos like this one or how to make emulsifying sugar scrubs how to make melt and pour soaps um, unboxing where to find business essentials etc subscribe to my channel because i show a lot on my entrepreneurship journey so if you're interested in my entrepreneurship journey or if you want to start your entrepreneurship journey subscribe to my channel like this video and go watch my other videos so i'm gonna whip this for about five minutes and come back and scrape down the sides of the bowl And do you see how the butter is already transforming? It went from liquid and now it's turning into actual butter. And it's so pretty. During this entrepreneurship journey, I realized whipping your butters different ways could give you different results. So I'm going to whip this for about 5 more minutes and that will be the end of the whipping process. And look how creamy and beautiful this butter looks. And let me tell you, it feels so amazing on your skin. So this brings us to the end of this video. I will be putting some links down below in case you're interested in more of my videos. If you have any questions, comment below. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And see you in the next one. Bye.